Welcome. In front of me is a Motorola Edge 30 Pro, and today I will show you how you can bypass the Google verification on this phone. Now, you can see that the phone I have right here is locked, and I can unlock it using the previously used pattern, or by tapping right here and using Google account. Now, considering we don't know any of those, that's the purpose of this video, we can bypass this by uh, number one, connecting to Wi-Fi, which you can see I already am connected, and number two, you will also need a SIM card for it with a PIN. Now, you don't need to know that PIN, so if you have some kind of like old SIM card that is laying around uh, that you just don't know the PIN, it will work. Uh, additionally, if you have a SIM card that you don't have a PIN set on, you can simply pop it into a different device, set one up, and then pop it back in here, and you're good to go. So, anyway, let's uh, take off the case right here. And I'm gonna pop in my card. There we go. And give it a second, it should show up with the screen, there we go. So you can see it tells, tells me to put in my uh, SIM card pin. And all we need to do now is take it out. Boop, and there we go. Now we are on a lock screen, as you can see right now, once you take it out, you can completely remove the SIM card. And uh, from here, you will see this uh, no signal, oh, not signed in. So we're gonna see, pull down on it, I assume. And let me quickly check. So from here, let's see if we can expand it, no. Manage maybe. Okay, so all we do is click on manage and from here we're gonna go into app settings. You wanna click on most recent and change it to all apps. Scroll all the way down to YouTube, click on it and then click on the YouTube icon itself and we're gonna select open. From here, click on the account, uh, go to help and feedback and we're looking for Actually, no, not help and feedback, my bad. Let's go back, settings, there we go. And from settings, we're gonna go into Google Privacy Policy, which is under About, and you YouTube, oh, Google Privacy Policy, there we go. Select Accept and Continue, and No Thanks. Now in here, you wanna top right at the top of the search bar and type in hardreset.info slash bypass. Like so. If you need a moment to write it down, do pause the video. And from here, once you open it up, uh, we will now go to the first, no, the first one, then the third one, which is the uh, settings application. You want to click on it, then you want to scroll down to accessibility, right up here. And then scroll down to. Oh, there we go, accessibility menu. Uh, you wanna turn it on, the shortcuts right here. It gives you this little pop-up that it appears right here. So to get it, I guess you do this. Oh, you click on it, okay. So let's let it, got it. <clears throat> and from here, we will now go to main menu right here of the settings. And we will navigate to apps, which is right at the top. Then you want to select see all 41 apps, tap on the three dots and then show system apps. Once you have that selected, you want to choose Android setup. There it is, Android setup. And you're going to select for stop and OK and go back. Next thing you want to do is also for stop Google Play services. So let's go back and scroll down right here to see There we go, Google, Google Play Services, right here. Click on it, 
And from here, you're gonna select disable, disable app, and for stop, and okay. So once you have disabled the Google Play services, we're gonna now just back out. There we go. And we're gonna now proceed with the setup. Now what will happen right now is after this screen, once we select don't copy, it's going to kind of stay on this page. It won't go anywhere further because we have disabled Google Play services. So the phone is right now trying to connect to uh, Google servers and it can't because Play services is disabled. So uh, what we're gonna do now is tap on this menu right here. We're gonna select Assistant. Nothing happened, let's try it again. There we go, it shows up with settings as you've seen right here. Now it is a fairly brief window right here. I'm gonna select Settings and then choose Enable. As you can see right now, it isn't closing for me. Hopefully it is the same way for you. Uh, but there is a chance, like on a lot of other devices, that it's just gonna close up after a, a second or a split second. So what you need to do is keep repeating this process till you can tap on Enable. That's basically all you need to do. Now this might take you from anywhere from like two tries like it did me, uh, all the way to maybe a hundred tries. So don't get discouraged. Uh, most likely you're doing everything correct, but the phone isn't uh, cooperating with you. So just keep on repeating it until it gets enabled. Now, once you do so, go back once, and this will now proceed further, as you can see, completely skipping the Google verification page. So what we can do right now is finish up the setup of our device, which will gain us access to the home screen. There we go. So once you're on your home screen, you want to navigate to your settings. From here, scroll all the way down to System, Reset Options, Erase All Data Factor Reset, Erase All Data. Click on the button once again, which will begin the factor reset of your device. Now, uh, I won't be going over this on the video, just because it's just a simple factory reset of the phone. Uh, once it's completed, it brings you back to the uh, actual like setup screen of the phone. But at that point, you can set up your device however you like. It is fully unlocked. So uh, go right ahead and just skip Wi-Fi connection if you don't want to connect to it. Uh, like I mentioned, the device will be fully unlocked. Now, I'm not going to go over it just because it just waits a, wastes a little bit of time and shows you no additional information because once you press this, the entire thing is finished. So there we go. So that is, that is basically how you would bypass the Google verification on this phone. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.